Diana Muldor, a distinguished actress with a notable career, has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Among her many accomplished works, one stands out as defining her career. Which performance do you believe holds that distinction? Alternatively, do you have a cherished memory associated with her? We invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic Hollywood actor in the comments below. Stay tuned as we've got some funny, shocking, and sad facts coming up. Keep watching for more insights into Diana Muldor's fascinating journey. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Share your thoughts and let's celebrate the legacy of this remarkable talent. Diana Muldor, an accomplished actress, has left an enduring impact on the entertainment industry through her diverse filmography. One of her standout performances defining an illustrious career is the role of Dr. Catherine Pulaski in Star Trek The Next Generation. The portrayal of the no-nonsense and intellectually formidable doctor showcased acting prowess and left an indelible mark on the iconic sci-fi series. For those new to Muldor's work, delving into her filmography offers a rich tapestry of performances across various genres. A must-watch film is The Swimmer, where she delivers a captivating performance alongside Burt Lancaster. Based on a short story by John Cheever, the film explores complex themes with Muldor contributing to the intricate narrative. Another gem in her filmography is Kinrak, a heartfelt drama where she shares the screen with John Voight. The film revolves around a young teacher's transformative journey in an impoverished community, and Muldor's portrayal adds depth to the compelling storyline. For fans eager to explore more of her work, MCQ stands out as a must-watch. Starring alongside John Wayne, she plays a pivotal role in this action-packed crime thriller, showcasing versatility as an actress. In the world of television, Muldor's performances extend beyond Star Trek. Her involvement in L.A. lore as Rosalind Shays is noteworthy. The character's shocking exit from the series left a lasting impression on viewers, a testament to her ability to bring complexity and intrigue to roles. In conclusion, Muldor's filmography offers a diverse array of performances that span decades and genres. For newcomers, starting with The Swimmer, Conrack, and MCQ provides a glimpse into compelling contributions to the cinematic landscape. Whether in film or television, her work continues to resonate with audiences, making her a standout presence in the annals of entertainment history. Throughout an illustrious career, Muldor received several awards and honors cementing her status as a respected figure in the entertainment industry. In the 1950s, her early forays into acting laid the foundation for a remarkable journey. In recognition of outstanding performances, she garnered the prestigious Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Guest Actress in a Drama Series for a role in the streets of San Francisco in 1972. This accolade underscored her ability to bring depth and authenticity to characters. As her career evolved, Muldor continued to receive accolades, with a notable achievement being the Saturn Award for Best Supporting Actress on Television for her portrayal of Dr. Catherine Pulaski in Star Trek The Next Generation. This recognition highlighted her impact within the science fiction genre. Beyond the 1950s, Muldor's lifetime achievements include the accolade of being a nominee for the Soap Opera Digest Award for Outstanding Actress in a Leading Role on a Primetime Serial, acknowledging contributions to the television landscape. Versatility was further acknowledged with a nomination for the Genie Award for Best Performance by a Foreign Actress for a Role in Threshold, showcasing the ability to excel in diverse cinematic endeavors. In the realm of television, her work in L.A., Lore earned critical acclaim and a nomination for the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Supporting Actress in a Drama Series. This recognition reflected her ability to captivate audiences through nuanced performances. In summary, Muldor's career is adorned with accolades such as the Primetime Emmy Award, Saturn Award, Soap Opera Digest Award, and Genie Award nominations. These honors testify to her enduring impact on both the small and big screens, solidifying her as a distinguished actress in the entertainment landscape. Diana Muldor's journey in the entertainment world encompasses noteworthy roles in both the original Star Trek series and its successor, Star Trek The Next Generation. Initially portraying scientists, she took on the role of Dr. Pulaski in the latter series, with the stipulation that the character's first name be changed to Catherine. 
Interestingly, Gates McFadden, who played another doctor on Star Trek, temporarily stepped away, leading to Ann Archer assuming the role in Patriot Games when McFadden returned. In 2013, Muldor sought a career resurgence on Martha's Vineyard, Massachusetts, after dedicating considerable time as a caregiver to her husband. This shift marked a pivotal moment in her professional trajectory. Her impact extends beyond Star Trek with a memorable moment in L.A. lore. The scene where her character, Rosalind Shaves, is discovered in bed with her adversary Leland McKenzie ranked as the 38th greatest television moment in 1991. This recognition underlines her ability to infuse complexity into roles, leaving a lasting impression on viewers. Her diverse career garnered accolades, including a Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Guest Actress in a Drama Series for the Streets of San Francisco in 1972. Notably, she received the Saturn Award for Best Supporting Actress on Television for her portrayal of Dr. Catherine Pulaski, showcasing her impact in the science fiction genre. Muldor's foray into Martha's Vineyard in 2013 and her standout L.A. lore moment reflect adaptability and the ability to make a lasting mark in different facets of the entertainment industry. The journey, marked by diverse roles and recognitions, stands as a testament to enduring impact. Diana Muldor, a 1960 graduate of Sweet Briar College, later returned to her alma mater as the commencement speaker on May 7, 2000. The address marked a significant moment, reflecting the enduring connection she maintained with her educational roots. Interestingly, she shares familial ties with actress Kathy Baker through her cousin. This connection adds a layer of familial association to her expansive career in the entertainment industry. Beyond her achievements in acting, Muldor is recognized as a notable breeder, owner, and judge of Airedale Terriers. Her involvement in the breeding and judging of these terriers showcases a lesser-known aspect of her life, demonstrating a passion beyond the realm of entertainment. In conclusion, Muldor's journey is multifaceted, extending from academic beginnings to familial connections and involvement in the world of Airedale Terriers. These diverse facets contribute to a comprehensive understanding of the woman behind the roles portrayed on screen, showcasing a life beyond the limelight. Diana Muldor faced challenges with line memorization during her stint on Star Trek, The Next Generation in 1987, as noted by director Paul Lynch. In order to assist her, cue cards were employed to display her lines, providing a workaround for the difficulty she encountered. Known for portraying characters with a title doctor, Diana's notable roles in the Star Trek series included biologist Dr. Anne Mulhall and psychologist Dr. Miranda Jones in the original series episodes Return to Tomorrow and Is There in Truth No Beauty, respectively. In Star Trek The Next Generation, she took on the role of physician Dr. Catherine Pulaski in Season 2, each character displaying an open-minded perspective towards the universe. It's interesting to note that Diana Muldor is the ex-sister-in-law of musician Maria Muldor, adding a familial dimension to her personal connections.